हाय वेलकम टू द नाइन्थ लेक्चर ऑफ द चैप्टर आयोनिक इक्विलिब्रिया टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी एन इम्पॉर्टंट पॉइंट कॉमन आयन इफेक्ट नाउ बिफोर लुकिंग एट द एक्चुअल स्टेटमेंट ऑफ कॉमन आयन इफेक्ट इनिशियली वी विल ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इज द कंसेप्ट नाउ टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस कंसेप्ट इनिशियली consider this diagram in this diagram we have this beaker in this beaker suppose if we have aqueous solution of ammonium hydroxide now we know that ammonium hydroxide it is a weak electrolyte that ammonium hydroxide as it is a weak electrolyte in aqueous solution it undergo partial ionization to form nh4 plus and oh minus now suppose that if in this solution we add another aqueous solution of ammonium chloride so this is the aqueous solution of ammonium chloride and we know that ammonium chloride is a strong electrolyte so it undergo almost complete ionization to form nh4 plus and cl minus so we have added that strong electrolyte into the aqueous solution of weak electrolyte now what is observed c when that ammonium hydroxide undergo ionization it will form nh4 plus and oh minus now when we add nh4 cl it gives us nh4 plus and cl minus so that nh4 plus and this nh4 plus so it is a common ion so our strong electrolyte provides us a common ion here it is nh4 plus now so what is happen see when ammonium hydroxide it under ionization it will form nh4 plus but when we adding ammonium chloride it provide us nh4 plus so that nh4 plus which is provided in the solution get combined with oh minus and again form nh4 oh okay i repeat see when that ammonium hydroxide it undergo ionization it will form nh4 plus and oh minus okay now when we add strong electrolyte it undergo complete almost complete ionization to form nh4 plus and cl minus and it provides us common ion that is nh4 plus and that nh4 plus combine with this oh minus and again form nh4 oh so what happens the ionization of ammonium hydroxide is suppressed or decreased initially it get ionized but as it get that nh4 plus ion that nh4 plus get combined with oh minus and again form nh4 oh so overall it is the suppression of or uh, decreasing of dissociation of ammonium hydroxide so this is the common ion effect now see what is the actual statement the dissociation or ionization of a weak electrolyte is suppressed or say it is decreased by the addition of strong electrolyte containing one of the same ions of electrolyte it's called as common ion effect so in this case that aqueous solution of nh4oh it is our weak electrolyte ammonium chloride it is our strong electrolyte we have added aqueous solution of it into the our original solution then it provided us nh4 plus which is our common ion so due to this the uh, ionization of ammonium hydroxide is suppressed so this is the actual statement now consider another example see suppose if we have acetic acid it is also a weak acid it undergo ionization it is partial ionization to form ch3co minus that it acetate anion and h plus now if in the aqueous solution of acetic acid if we add aqueous solution of sodium acetate now sodium acetate it is a strong electrolyte therefore it undergo almost complete ionization to form acetate ion and na plus now we have common ion acetate anion so as it undergo ionization our strong electrolyte provides 
एसिटेट एनायन एंड दैट एसिटेट एनायन कंबाइंस विद एच प्लस एंड अगेन फॉर्म सी एच थ्री सी ओ एच सो द आयोनाइजेशन और द डिसोसिएशन ऑफ एसिटिक एसिड इज सप्रेस्ड ओके सो दिस इज कॉमन आइन इफेक्ट व्हाट इज द स्टेटमेंट द डिसोसिएशन और आयोनाइजेशन ऑफ ए वीक इलेक्ट्रोलाइट इज सप्रेस्ड बाय द एडिशन ऑफ स्ट्रांग इलेक्ट्रोलाइट कंटेनिंग वन ऑफ द सेम आयन्स ऑफ वीक इलेक्ट्रोलाइट इज कॉल्ड एज कॉमन आयन इफेक्ट ओके सो दिस इज ऑल अबाउट द कॉमन आयन इफेक्ट थैंक यू